Welcome to today's video, where we will learn about one of the rarest animals in the world, the cockerel's shefuck. They have a lifespan of up to 30 years. Their young gestate for about five months, usually with one offspring per birth. At birth, they can weigh between three to four ounces and mature at two and a half years old. Adults range in size from eight to nine and a half pounds. There are approximately 36 lemurs native to the island of Madagascar, including the cockerel's shefak. These stunning primates differ from other lemurs by their dramatic mode of locomotion. Sitting upright, they spring through the trees using the strength of their back legs. This is called vertical clinging and leaping, and it is a sight to behold. The name shefak, a Malagasy word, comes from its distinct call as it travels through the treetops. Shefak. Female shefaks are dominant over males and get first dibs on food and mates. A mid-sized lemur, males and females are strikingly marked. Chestnut brown patches on the chest and limbs pop against the white hair that covers the body. Bright yellow eyes peer out from the hairless black face. Long, strong limbs and a long tail make their arboreal travel graceful, swift, and seemingly effortless. It can be hard to hear a shefok unless it is threatened. Cockerel shefoks have a limited collection of vocal calls. They are most commonly heard quietly humming, though they give off loud sounds of alarm when startled. Loud aerial roars are directed at predatory birds, and the characteristic Shefak, shefak, shefak is used to warn group members of danger. Life in the trees protects shefak groups from the few predators that share their forest homes. Loud piercing alarm calls warn of danger. All members of the group may simultaneously produce the explosive nasal hiss-like call shefak. This distinctive call made by all shefox is what gives the lemur group its name. Cockerel's shefox live on the island of Madagascar. These lemurs reside in small forest pockets in northwestern parts of the country, in the Ankara Fansika Nature Reserve and the Bora Special Reserve. Both of these areas have been damaged by annual fires set by nearby farmers. Hunting of shefox might occur in some areas, although in many parts of its range it is protected by taboo. Cockerel shefox are most at home in the tops of trees, where they can often be found feeding, playing, or sleeping. They gracefully leap across large distances to move from tree to tree. Though these lemurs spend much of their time in the forest canopy, they are also comfortable on the ground. Here they hop like kangaroos, bouncing off their back feet with arms raised high in the air. Leaves make up most of the shefox diet, although they also eat flowers, fruit, bark, and dead wood. In human care, vegetables such as carrots, sweet potatoes, onions, and corn are also on their menu. Individuals lie on, sit on, or hang from branches when eating their meal. Family life. Cockerel shefox begin their daily activities near sunrise. They often soak up the morning sun, basking in the treetops with their arms stretched out before heading out to find food. Small groups of males, females, and young move slowly through the trees in search of food. They may travel up to a mile before the end of their daily trek, which generally occurs before sunset. Life in the trees protects seafoc groups from the few predators that share their forest homes. Loud, piercing alarm calls warns of danger. Shefox live in small, social groups of males and females numbering three to ten individuals of varying ages. Aside from mothers and their offspring, group members are not necessarily related to one another. Members sleep and forage together. They even share territory with other nearby groups. Females may mate with males outside of their immediate group, 
Males often roam around for long distances to find mates from multiple groups. Many child care duties are shared between group members. Infants ride on the back of mom or other group members as they travel to find food. Between three and four months of age, the infants are capable of moving about on their own, and mothers give them a helpful nip to encourage their independence. Youngsters become sexually mature around the age of three and a half years. The oldest individuals raised in human care live to the age of 30. Conservation Loss of habitat is the main reason for declining population sizes in cockerel shefox. Unfortunately, little is known about actual numbers. Historical information on population size is lacking, though known population declines and decreases in available habitat occurring within recent generations lead many to suspect a population decline of 50% within the past five decades. Safeguarding of populations within existed protected areas and community-based conservation actions are both needed to help ensure the shefox continued survival. Fun facts about cockerel shefox? In some cultures, shefox are often viewed as sacred sun worshippers. This traditional view very likely stems from the shefox's curious habit of basking in the early morning sun before heading out to forage for food. Whether through the trees or on the ground, these shefox can jump. They can easily fly across expanses of nearly 40 feet to move from one tree to another. On the ground, they dance, hopping in a kangaroo-like fashion. Shefox, like many other lemurs, have modified lower incisors specialized for grooming. Tall, slender, and evenly spaced, these teeth help to comb and clean the hair. Resting individuals are commonly seen licking and combing one another's hair. Group members huddle together on cold nights. Individuals sit single file along a branch to help retain heat. Some have described the sight as appearing similar to people on a toboggan. And that's our video for today. If you enjoyed, please press like and subscribe. Thank you for watching.